How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back to... Yes, I know Steam op Steam's open, thank you. Welcome back to the Crooked Man. <sighs> so, not gonna lie, I actually started this up a little bit after getting so freaking confused on where to go. I'd been wandering around the area, haven't found anything yet, I had to look up what the heck I was supposed to do next. I found a lot of walkthroughs that were not very, like, they were vague enough to where you could tell what you needed to do, but doesn't give anything away, which is nice, especially for an old game like this. Anyway, apparently I have to go back here. Yay. Like, that's literally it. Go back to this room. Go to this room. Go to this room. Like, okay, all right, all right. Well, that's good enough for me. Uh, didn't say that was open. The basement doors? Uh, yeah. Um, I don't like that. I still don't like that. Is he still in here, or is he gone? I would assume he's probably gone. Yeah, he's gone. Oh, what's that? That wasn't there before, was it? There's something here. Got a bronze key. What? Why? I can only imagine how many different maps, that, like, if bear, how many different varieties of the same map there are. Strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Okay. I still don't get... What does that have anything to do with anything? Um... Okay, I only read, read the beginning part. I actually have no idea where to go from here. Uh, now that I'm thinking about it... Is Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde in the library or something? Am I supposed to read that or something? S-T. That'd be a strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. That's not in there. Okay, I guess not. Or maybe I'm doing it too soon? I don't know. The only locked door I could think of that would allow a key would be this one. Okay. A bar. Alright then. A journal seemingly written by a staff member. The last page is rambling and sloppily written. A toast to our owner who left his employees and fled into the night. We'll drink all the beer we've got. Hell, it's the only good thing here. Being out of a job's no good, but at least we don't have to see his mug no more. Wow, this guy was hated. We were so sick of that egghead. Always trying to flaunt his intelligence. Installing weird stuff for the basement door. Having a number lock on the food store. What? All his silly crap made the place impossible to run. Plus, the passcode was this thing with the book, which he changed up every month. The hell do you do if you forget? Maybe it's good for him? But sure as hell not for us. <sighs> Whatever. Once we're done with the booze, we're out of here. A toast to our bright futures. The door to the food storage is at the far end of the first floor, right? Passcode on food is pretty absurd. Yeah, just a little bit. Um, Where am I supposed to find a passcode? I would have already found a slip that would have said something like that if it existed, wouldn't I? A library, maybe? I haven't exactly checked the shelves at all, except for that one. 
I don't know. I guess we could try. What did he say, by the way? Just a few wine bottles. They seem to be full. Brandy. It's got tons of alcohol on it. I might, get, I might just catch fire if I drink this. I would catch fire if I drank that. <laughs> empty bottle, empty beer bottles. Empty beer bottles. Empty beer bottles? Yep, empty beer bottles. I'm just gonna assume all the beer here is gone. Oh my god, I can't. I can't control how many times I go in and out the door. I just like going in and out doors so much. Don't judge me. Uh, where's the light? Ah, right there. So, be like in here or something. N to M, O to P, Q to R, S to T. Wait, what? The blackboard in the owner's room said the strange case of Jekyll, uh, Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. It'd be on the shelf, right? I guess. Why didn't you do this before? I'm just looking for a slip of paper. That's it. Ah, here we go. Chapter 1, Story of the Door. Mr. Utterson, the lawyer, was a man of... Wait, is this actually... Why are we reading The Strange Case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde? Uh... Am I missing something? Last night, Mr. What? What does this have anything to do with anything? Okay. Search for Mr. H Hyde. Um... Okay. The Carew murder case in the month of October 18. So, what? Is this going to be like the passcode? Is it going to be like. One zero one eight? Is that what it's supposed to be? Or one eight one zero? I don't know. Depends on the location you're from. <laughs> uh one zero one eight, I guess. I'm going to assume that's kind of important. <gasps> uh I no way that that monster did it really uh 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 move 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 it's coming this way crap I gotta escape what do I do maybe if I drop him down here hi I was gonna try I was going to say I was going to try to jump down there. That was my plan. This works too. <laughs> what is that monster? So what I saw earlier what so what I saw earlier really was to think that thing actually exists. The crooked man. Yeah, something that's based off the Mother Goose rhyme that's supposed to symbolize two nations exists as a physical horror being.
But still, there's no way it's coming back from the fall. And the room under here is locked tight. Well, there's a way. There is a way, and I know said way, and I know the reason. I should warn Sissy when I see her. I knew it would be dangerous for her. Well, that wasn't... I thought that was going to be a lot more deadly than it was. I... I, I in my mind, I was going to go, okay, save the next time you see him. Save the next time you think he's going to come. And he appears, and I'm like, I don't save. And now I'm like, oh, okay, crap. Maybe I should have saved. <laughs> um, sissy? Where the flying hell are you? I don't know. I'm going to see if I can go in here. In case I get this wrong, I'm going to have an added save file. Just in case. All right. I think it's one zero one eight. No. Hmm. All right. I'm gonna do some deep searching, see if I miss something. I'm gonna run around, try to find anything. Uh, to spare you guys some time, I won't have you guys see this, but I'll be back in just a moment once I have found the code. I'm looking for and I'll explain then how I got it. See you guys in a sec. Oh, sorry about the sound. Or the no sound, I should say. So I've been thinking about this for a while. Um, there's really only one other thing that I can think of other than 1018, October of 18. Um, or again, I guess I could have tried 1810. I'll try that in a sec. I haven't tried that passcode yet. Um... I'm looking through this, and the only thing that really comes to my mind, one, two, four, three is missing, five, six is missing, and seven is missing. Three, six, seven, nine. So either it's 1810, which I can try again. With all this stuff, I I may I don't know. I'm I I'm very forgetful. Did I try it? No, no, because I came right. I I came over here immediately afterwards. So, you guys didn't miss any attempts. Um, let's go ahead and head back. Try eighteen ten, and then try. Um, what was it again? Crap. I need to write this down, or I'm gonna forget. Uh, except I. Never mind. I was going to say I don't have paper, but I have paper. I'm just not very smart. <sighs> Plus, I've got a lot of these. Anyway, so... What is it? Okay, three. So it's either... In my mind, the way I develop it, it would have to do with this. Um, it's either 1810. Again, for obvious reasons. We've already tried 1018. I haven't... You guys haven't missed any. Uh, so, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three, six, seven, nine. Okay, so it's either eighteen, ten, or three, six, seven, nine. I'm gonna head back over there now. It doesn't. I'm kind of happy. It, it it doesn't take very long to get over there. Um, but like seriously, I was probably sitting there trying to. I was like sitting here do it like this, trying to figure that out for like 20 minutes maybe. I'm like, good grief. Anyway, let's go and try, we'll try 1810 first. 1810. Nope, that of course wasn't it. So, this is literally the only other idea I have. This is the only other idea I have. If this isn't right, I have no idea what it's going to be. Three, six, seven, nine. That was it, apparently. Okay. Well, I'm smart, sort of. It takes me a long time to be smart, but I'm smart. <laughs> okay. What is that, by the way? What is on top of that thing? Also... Just in case that guy somehow escapes. Double save. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
You see something shimmering, but it's out of reach. How do I get it in reach? Can I climb on this? Wooden box. Stacks of beer cases. A ladder. I could use this to get up to that thing. Whatever that thing might be. Why would I do this? I have no idea. Got the key to 209. Let me guess. You want me to go to 209 game? You're going to force me to go there, aren't you? I'm not going to be given a choice, am I? Oh, boy. I, I, I just want to go in this door spastically. Don't mind me. All right, we're going to 209, I guess. I have no idea where Sissy is. Wait. This is a bar. Is this 209? That's 208. Okay, this is 209. Lock the door. Glass. That's the first thing I notice when I look in this room. The glass that's down over there. That's the only that's the first thing that comes to my eyes. I'm afraid to approach that. Um Looks like a bathroom. Yay, you know how to see. The dresser is empty. Looks like something went, was badly burnt. Was this a photo? There's something under the pieces. Scrap from a notebook. I don't need her memory anymore because I know she won't come back. I have to erase everything good and bad and all the memories inside of me too. It, what? I'm remin- okay. I was gonna read this after the series, but this is making me think of a poem, the full poem version for this game particularly that I found of the Crooked Man. It takes it takes the original um, Mother Goose rhyme and puts an extremely dark spin on it. Um, let's see, do I actually still have it? I might be able to show it off if I do. Okay. Silence will happen in a sec, even though it's just wind right now. I guess it's not that big of a deal. Let me see if I can display the thing I'm talking about really quick. Okay, there's silence. Um, yeah, I still have it. Okay. This. I found this. Maybe it's actually in the game. I don't know. But that top section, that is in the game, at the beginning of the game. But... There, uh, past it, but the crooked man was sad, and once he had a thought, why should he be crooked when others they were not? Everything was worthless. He heaved a great big sigh and went and found a rope and tied it to the sky. We can already tell what's happening after this. This guy was obviously stupid depressed. And, I mean, the more I read this, I was like, maybe that's the hanging is why his neck is in the position it is. I mean, if my freaking mouse will work. Okay. Look at that. His neck is curved over, but you can see, like, the line that caused the hanging. So it's like... Ugh, it's dark. Anyway... That being shown off, let's, well, if you guys want to read the rest of the poem, you can go ahead. I'm not going to. I'm going to get back to the game now in three, two, one. Let's do this. Let's finish this off really quick. I don't need her memory anymore because I know she won't come back. That was the depressing side of him. I feel like he was already getting the thoughts of, um, why is my, why am I crooked and no one else isn't? I hate myself, I want to die, yada, yada, yada. I feel like this was being thought during that process. This was not supposed to happen. Well, I mean, it obviously was supposed to happen, but I did not expect this. What was that, and why? Phew. 
It's easing up. Sheesh, I'm exhausted. I guess I haven't slept much. Gee, I wonder why. So he burnt this photo to mend his broken heart. Huh. I know I couldn't do that. I'll never forget. Never. According to Paul, that makes me a pansy. Is it really? Oh, hi, sissy. This is not... Okay, you know what? Fine, whatever. I guess we're just going to progress this way. Extensive episode! Well, not really, but still. Sissy. Oh, there you are, David. Hi. Where were you? What's up? Did you find the box? No, I can't find it. There are lots of rooms I can't get into, so it might be in one of those. What's wrong, David? You look kind of pale. If you saw what I just saw, you would know why. Oh, it's nothing. But sissy, you should really leave soon. Why? You may not believe me, but there's some kind of bizarre monster around. I found it in the basement. I was attacked by it earlier. You'd definitely be in danger, too. So I think you should go. Look, I don't like dark, scary places either. But there's no need to tease me like that. I'm not a kid afraid of the boogeyman, okay? Funny you should say that. Wrong game, sissy. <laughs> Er, sorry, but I'm not trying to tease you. I'm telling the truth. Hee <laughs> hee. Don't worry, I'm not mad. You don't seem like a dishonest guy, so I'd like to believe you, but a monster? Maybe you mistook something in the dark. Actually, yes. That's not really much of a monster. A person with a bloody body and just a bent over neck because of the hanging? That's. that's not a monster. At least I wouldn't consider that a monster. I would just consider that sad to see. I'd like to think you're right. Alright, if you insist, but be careful, okay? I know. Well, I'll go looking elsewhere. Well. Didn't get to see you for very long. Alright, well, we're going to progress the game... Next time. I, the, the guide that I looked up at the beginning of this, I did not... It, it led... I looked up literally one room, and one thing led to another, and my brain's just like... Think anything up at this point. Ugh. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I'm gonna leave this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode of The Crooked Man. Still got a long ways to go, according to what I've heard. There's supposed to be like four scenes, and we're still in the first. That's going to be fun. Um, if you did like this video, though, push that like button in. So far, you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. If you have any suggestions for any other um, RPGs or horror games you'd like to see me do, let me know in the comments below. Want to check out any others that I've done prior to this game? I'll link to one of them down over there. This game, however, will be across to my head over here. In the meantime, I'm out, but I'll see you guys later. Bye.